Hannah, what are the considerations going into Monday with so much of the NL wildcard picture so uncertain? Yeah, so the, the league obviously hasn't announced anything. They haven't made any decision yet, and ultimately it comes down to what Rob Manfred thinks is best for the integrity of the competition and what's going to be the most fair to everyone involved. At this point, they could play two games, one game, or no games. They, they will play the games, obviously, if it has implications for who gets into the postseason. If it's just about seeding, they probably won't or they possibly mm. won't play them at all, yeah. which is comes down to kind of, you know, do you really care to, if you're facing the Padres or the Brewers if it means having to play 18 innings the day before the wild card game starts? If they if it matters for getting in and they that whatever that uncertainty is, is decided in the first game, they may be not playing the second game at all, which to me, the, the trickiest for the Mets is the possibility the Mets could have locked up a postseason spot by then, but the Braves could still be playing to determine whether or not mm. the Braves or the D-backs get that final wild card spot. And that, to me, is a really tough spot for the Mets to be. Then you're essentially collateral damage, playing potentially 18 innings the day before your three-game wild card series starts. And it doesn't really matter to you. So do you want to put mm -hmm. your best players out there or do you want to potentially let yourself get swept mm -hmm. by the Braves yeah. going into the postseason? My wheels are turning as you're talking. Uh, first of all, my brain is not uh, like mm. fitted for this kind of stuff. <laughs> yeah. So this could be a stupid thing to say. I wish we had our background MLB official uh, on set that we could, I could ask this question. Yeah. Do you think there's any chance that they could start game one on Monday? not knowing if they'll need to play the second game. Yes. So you might or might not be in inning one of nine or one of 18 at that moment. That's exactly right. That's Ooh, my point. It's I like very, that. It's very, like, the, if it gets decided, they might just be like, we don't need to play anymore. But then... Wait, hey, wait a second. How that impacts even, if they're going to use Diaz in game one or not. How would that even be possible? Kind of, All the games will be done Sunday, except for the Mets and Braves. I don't know. So I'm just asking. Will, you'll know Sunday if those games need to be played. You'll know but at what least if the result one. of game what, what one. What if only the, one game needs to be played? Right. But they now I'm even confused. And by the way, real quickly, <laughs> I want to just uh, who's making this decision? Like, let's say that the Rob Manfred. Well, commission. well, let's say it comes down to the seating. Manfred's going to make that call, yes. or does he go to the Mets and say, "Hey, do you care who you're playing here? Would you uh, rather play this game? Would you rather play right. these games, or would you rather wait uh, or, or not play the games and just go travel now, or wait and find out who you would be playing if you had a higher seed?" That's Manfred. He or works that's for the owners, he, so he has to consult with them. But it's his decision. 